Hello and welcome to the Project Genesis Alpha footage by Takahitsu. Hello and welcome everybody. This is Takahitsu and I am back with the pre-alpha of uh, yeah, Project Genesis. Wow, sudden brain fart. So something interesting here, they have changed it. They have released what they call the Andromeda version. So I'll be going through each one of the ships and showing you guys essentially what it is this is the s301 looks pretty decent if you ask me I like these big blue things they look pretty they look pretty epic if you ask me I'm not really sure what they are though um, then there is the Hulk this is the h402 big ship this one is big and hulky you know um, I like all these massive amount of turrets they have up here. The one thing I think is a downside is I don't think its turrets can move yet. So I have actually come up with a method on making it useful, even though its turrets don't move. Um, this is the Hulk 2. Um, it does not have anywhere near as much firepower. I'm not really sure what it has that the other one doesn't. This is the fighter... I'm not really sure. I don't remember what half of them are called, but I'm pretty sure this is the fighter, the F202. I don't see where you can put decals, but I'm okay with that. Um, I never really knew what this one was called. <laughs> but this one's a pretty cool ship. It's really fast and it's really hard to shoot. Um, this one, um, the Terran, is pretty cool. I'm not... like I don't know what all the differences between the ships are particularly, other than some of them have more weapons... Some have more armor. This is the D Park. This is basically the the generic ship, like their their default. Um, it was described that the D Park was supposed to be like the hero of the game, or like the, you know if you were playing a campaign, that was the ship that you were in, you know. So I'm not sure if that's changing or what's going on. Here's the F201, and this is like a little to me. This one reminds me of Homeworld and the Interceptor class. For, I think it was not the Titan, but the other one, whatever the other race was called. Because all their ships are kind of flat like this. But that's what this one reminds me of. Without further ado, we're going to jump in and kill something. Alrighty, everyone. So, as you can see, they've definitely changed this up a lot. We're going to start with the S301. Look at that coming in, all red and glorious looking. Looks like uh, our shields are still up. So we're doing good. Um, looks like they've changed the way the team's balanced. You have better movement and everything. The graphics are way better than the other stuff. I'm, I'm already liking the Andromeda. I don't know about you guys, but I'm already liking the Andromeda. Okay, so let's see here. We got someone coming over here, player 257. We got Terry over there. So we are the blue, red team. Okay kind of awkward that it shows us as Ooh, look at that the boost looks epic okay kind of awkward that it still shows us as um the uh blue team like this is gonna throw me off right here but you know it is whatever Terry's still sitting there. I'm not sure what's going on with that. Maybe he's uh, maybe he's recording or something. Oh, we got brother, brother Belial, Belial. Okay, let's get into range here so we can start fighting. Let's get some pew pew in here. Help out our buddy against this brother man. Uh, we got Terry sitting there still having issues okay I'm just gonna sit here and launch cluster bombs over and over oh that might not have been the right person is friendly fire a thing now might very well be a thing I have destroyed the shields all right so they've got this dog fight going on I'm gonna go ahead and join them that was interesting. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and jump up here and join him. He's winning against the stalker, so we're gonna go ahead and do this. Not sure if he's realized that I'm, you know, he knows I'm here. Launching 
missile after missile after missile. And it's not going to work in his favor, unfortunately, for him. Alright, so we did take him down. Um, Terry's still sitting there. Player 257's flying all over the place. Um, we got player 263. We're starting to get some... We're starting to get some numbers here, so let's see what it all looks like. Um, yeah, we got five versus four at the moment. That's not terrible. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. I did take out the shields, so we're ahead of them. That's what the little red hatch mark is. I don't know what they're doing flying all the way out there. They must just be exploring. Um, the game is definitely something you want to explore and look around with. I mean, look at this graphics and stuff. They're definitely getting up there. It's definitely better than it was beforehand. Um, I'm going to have to kill Terry. Oh, it doesn't reach. Oh, it does. You can see the number above him is very small. It says 120 of 150. Oh, we got people incoming. All right. Alright, brother Belial. You have messed with the wrong Takahitsu. And somebody else got the kill. Kokoro got the kill. Alright, well, here you go. I already took out the shield. Alright, we're gonna go in. We're gonna take a new look at the inside and see what things look like from here. Obviously, all the graphics have been spoofed up, everything is much fancier. Um, they fixed the mouse settings so you can move and look around a lot better now. So everything is fantastic. We are in here with the stalker. So here's the security room. And I'm just looking at the moment. I will hack this so we can look at the front of the building, or the front of the ship too. You know, the command center. Um, I don't know if ammunition has become a thing. Swapping weapons is a lot easier. Yup. And I'm not going to go ahead and rush this because, um, well, a couple reasons. But the biggest reason is that we got a lot of new players with us today. They don't know what they're doing, and I don't want to just destroy them. They haven't even taken out the shield in our ship yet. I don't think they've even realized where it is yet. This is kind of fun to watch everybody sitting there kill people. I know I haven't done anything yet, but that's okay. Stalker's probably in here doing stuff. Yep. So the Stalker's figuring out how the ship works. Um, which is all good. I'm going to go ahead and finish it. And we'll get on to the next ship that I can show everybody. I know my mouse setting is really high. Um, which kind of throws a lot of people off. Pretty sure the aiming is better now, by the way, too. Um, it didn't used to work all that well, and it's definitely working a bit better now. So, you know. They have no clue that we're here, do they? I think our, I'm gonna not gonna lie, I'm pretty sure most of our team is newer players. Okay, so Stalker's running around doing his stuff. gets sticky I apologize for that so we have to go over here he doesn't know you can't go in there just yet or you can okay so maybe this doesn't need to be hacked I'm hacking it anyways and we're gonna finish it unfortunately all the guys outside don't even realize that we're in here doing this but it's all good So if you notice, there's like all kinds of little schematics. There's all kinds of cool stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and finish this one just because we can. And because we're not the only ones inside doing this. Next one, we'll play around with some of the other guys a little bit more. Get some kills. Get myself on that kill board again. They probably wiped it again. 
But that's going to be all the time I got for you guys today. So thank you for watching. This is Taki from Taikoo's Gaming. This is Project Genesis the Alpha Footage. I hope you liked everything. If you did, please hit the like, the thumbs up, um, subscribe if you're new, and uh, hit the bell icon. It does things. Good night.